Hey, yo, what are ya? And welcome back to The Walking Dead. I went a little too far and I told, um, I can't remember his name, but I told him that up? Lee died and everybody from Rebecca last night. died and all the people died. Once she gets going, there's no bringing and he her was back. pretty sad. Her bark's worse than um, She's all talk. And I scared she Rebecca. She was in a mood last night, that's for sure. I told her to be nicer to me. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. I like this guy. I want to hang I'm around with him. Teach you how to shoot. By that um, way, taught proper. My friend, maybe. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. Yeah, but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing would probably knock you on your ass. I don't know about that. I'm Nick pretty strong. Your age, first time I took him hunting, came across this beautiful 13 point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes and then we killed his ass. Lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, "I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it." Oh, that's sad. Hey, why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, so I got <laughs> the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me. And of course, the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Oh, yeah. You almost That's Nick. Her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She Maybe because you okay. give me a hard that. time. It's fine. He apologized. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. He's not trying to embarrass him, I don't think. I think he's just trying to tell a nice story. Trying to make Clementine feel so like anyway, part of the family. I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's, figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. He doesn't hate you. Nick's father wasn't there much. And he was a piece of shit when he was. So it fell to me to keep him in line. Raise him right. Meant I couldn't just be nice Uncle Pete. Uncle Pete! I think he took it a little too hard on him, though, when he raised him. It's okay to be hard on people, but you can't be too hard. Or you're just going to ruin the relationship. Jesus. All right, what's going on? What's going on? Something bad going... Oh, man. 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 Uh, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure it was you, Sam. But it ain't your average gang of thugs. That much I know. Think about it. You're Carver. What do you do? Who's Carver? Oh, man. Who's Carver? He's, he's a big guy. Check those guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. He's like the godfather of hillbillies. We got him enough for a kind of fuse. Hot lead right through the face. Zombies love that stuff. Puts them right to sleep. This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. No, through the nuts. Check the rest. Of course the head. Ammo. Where else do you think it would be? Yo, Uncle Pete. Not, not to burst your bubble there, big guy, but I'm pretty sure that if these guys are as professional as you say, they already have the ammo if it's on them. So I'm just gonna talk to you. What can I do? See if you can find anything else. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. Okay, now that makes more sense, Uncle Pete. Now you're really thinking with your head, Uncle Pete. Okay, Uncle Pete, glad we had this talk. Bye bye, Uncle Pete. See you later, Uncle Pete. Okay. Since this guy's such a screw up, I think I'm gonna go talk with him and, you know, try and figure out what's going on. Oh, no, wait. Maybe he's just focusing on this guy because there's something wrong. What a mystery. Oh, no, you're just going to be a dick. Why, thank you. Thanks. 
You know what, Nick? I do like Uncle Pete better. He's not a bitch. I thought I saw a couple of them over there. That's where I want to go, but it doesn't look like I can ford the river. I want to go across. Oh, here we go. Jackpot. All right, all right. There's got to be some way across. <laughs> I, f I find it a little difficult to control Clementine or any of the characters in Telltale games when you're trying to use a keyboard. What's this doing here? It's a pallet. What do you think it's doing there? It's to carry shit. Oh, maybe it's like... No, it's, I thought it might be a trapdoor, but... What if they floated them down here? For some reason. What if they floated them down here to attract other zombies? That would be absolutely a dick move. And I would very much not appreciate that. Thank you very much. All right, there's got to be something else here. We got some blood. Come on, I should be able to go across the river. I want to go across the river. Oh, yeah, let's talk to Pete. Hello, um, Peter. Yes, I would like to tell you that there is a pallet over here. It seems quite out of place, and uh, there are no forklifts around, so I have no idea what it could be for. But I, 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 I just don't know what to do right now. So, Uncle Pete, can you please help me, please? Is he shot too? Yeah, these fellows got lit up. Something good. Okay, why, th why? Thank you for all the help you have given me. I really appreciate that, Uncle Pete. Oh, oh! I thought I saw a finger. Where's that finger? Where's that finger? Take a look around. Just be careful. Damn it, I'm trying. Everybody in the Walking Dead series is just like, hey man, uh, why, don't, why don't you go do all the grunt work and do all the leg work? Why don't you just walk everywhere and do everything? Well, I just, I just stare off into the dip, distance, apathetically looking at the mountains and thinking how beautiful they are until a zombie bites off my face. Because we never pay attention here in the Walking Dead series. Are you sure you're okay? Ask my uncle. He knows everything. What? 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 I thought. I thought. Oh, there we go. There are more out there. This wasn't no rinky-dink pissing match. What was it then? Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now! Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself! What if someone's alive, Nick? Who cares? Cause they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're, you're a pussy. That nobody in this world is ever going to give a goddamn whether you like something or not. you got to grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, Clem. You want to be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this. All universe. right, Uncle Just Pete. Like I'm on it. I'm on it. You always so agreeable? No. Good. You'll fit right in with this outfit. <laughs> Look. Just keep your head on straight. Oh, no. I don't think anybody's going to be telling us anything, Uncle Pete. Don't shoot him. You're going to make some noise. Shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good. It doesn't look familiar. Whoa. So, who made the spears? Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. All right. I thought he was going to pull a Lee and just completely curb stomp him in the face. But no, he's not as badass as Lee. Come on, go, go towards him. There you go. I don't want to control. He's getting there, but he's not Duke Nukem Lee levels. All right, what's up? My backpack. Oh, no, please. Please do not be Omid or Krista. Please. Who's that? 
Okay, we gotta talk to him quick. He's going down. He's got yellow eyes. Um, what happened to you? Come on, man. Come on, tell me. Krista, the woman I was with. What happened to her? Please, tell me. Tell, tell me. me now. All right, you tell me. I'll give you something. You, I'll scratch your back if you scratch mine. You tell me. Um, yeah, whatever. I think he can't talk. That's why he's coughing so much. What? What? Oh, no. I'm fine. I'm fine. Just, just lost my footing. Damn it! God. Is he being bit? That's a bite. That's a bite. Oh no! Chop your leg off. Oh no! Lurkers, I'm out of ammo. Come this way, bitch. Damn it! You get your asses over here, both of you. I'll cover you. We gotta get out of here. Get over here, guys. Wait, is he dead? Can Damn you it! Listen to me once, just one time. Come on! Come on! Jesus! Oh man. What do I do? I use my hammer. Hammer. Oh no, we can use this pallet. Whatever. Bow! Yeah, now you take notice. Bip! Beat you with your own arm. Oh man, how are we gonna save? How are we gonna save? Oh, oh no. That's all he's got left. Uncle Pete, no! We have to go. I just met everybody in this series that I start to like, or I start to enjoy their company. They immediately are killed. Next time on The Walking Dead. What are you gonna do? Yeah. Almost there. as cool as Lee. Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Did he say what his name was? We know damn well who it was. Who is he? One of the guys we were with before. What's he gonna do? Bad things. But stuff. I can't keep going. I figure we got about four. Five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. We're just trying to make our way. Wait, where is Pete? I don't see him in the party. Who comes back? Who is it? I've seen a few pictures on the internet, and they show Kenny with a huge-ass beard. So I'm gonna guess Kenny, because that's like the northerner look. Survival. Did you try to save Krista? Hell yeah. You and 58% of players stopped to help Krista. Did you kill the dog? You and 52% of players killed the dog. Why, 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 man? Oh, I am the majority. All right, I was gonna say, why didn't everybody kill the dog? It was like three seconds from death. Did you accept Nick's apology? Yes. You and 51.1% of players accepted Nick's apology. Generosity. Did you give the water to the dying man? You and 43.2% of players gave the water to the dying man. Why am I in the minority in this one? Nah, you don't get no water. You killed Krista, you little bitch. Did you save Nick or Pete? You and 59.6% of players went with Pete. Wait, Nick doesn't die, does he? Why am I even asking? Why do I always ask questions? We'll find out. You and me, even though you probably already know. Maybe I'll watch the intro of the next episode. I kind of want to end it there, but... It's only been like eight minutes, man. And 
I want to see what's going to happen next. Or at least just give me some hint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Here we go. Season. I mean, not season two. Well, it is season two, but episode two. I just need to know what's going to happen next. I can't end on a cliffhanger this time, man. On the Walking Dead. Yeah. Is that Lee's voice? I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about coal. Now I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I don't man. know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. If Think Pete or your car, you know, you well, I don't really care if Nick dies, but Carver? if Pete dies. I want him to be my dad. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. Just, just lost my footing. Damn it, Damn it Pete. Damn it. Come this way. Damn it, you get your ass Why doesn't everybody wear boots? Just wear boots. Hey, somebody chopped off my arm. It hurt. Nick, just just run away. Look like look how slow they're walking. In the show it makes sense how they overtake them so fast because they all just appear out of nowhere somehow because they're so quiet. They're like ninjas. I don't really know how. But here they're just like slowly ambling up as they somehow don't see them. And then there's only like four of them. Ooh, that music is cool. That's cool. There's only like four or five zombies each time, and then they just get totally overtaken, and they can't even handle these really slow zombies. I don't know, maybe I'm just being weird. Let me inside. Let me inside. There's some beefaroni in there, and I want it. On the downside, we can't get through them. You don't know the power of the zombies, Pete. All right, there's only one thing you can do, man. Just chop it off. Get rid of it. He's, he's, he's only wearing ankle socks, too. What are you going to do? My friend this time. He, he, he did the same thing. As you're gonna do right now. It's worth a shot, I guess. I got nothing to lose. Other than my piggly wigglies, of course. <laughs> this little piggy went to market, this little piggy went to school, and this little piggy got hacked off a bloody stump and died. And he cried forever. Come on, man, you can do it. Like what? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. Just... Just give me a minute. Man, Lee cut it off without even second thought. You're not even close to being as badass as Lee. I'll try to find something to help. Oh, he doesn't look so good. He looks like he's got a fever. Whoa, that was quick. <laughs> he fell asleep in seconds. Um, Lee put a tourniquet on his little doohickey when he cut it off, so that's what I think I'm gonna do. If I can find it. Ooh, a radio. You can play some tunes. Q104. This is the channel of rock. 
Just sit back and listen to the free ride. Oh, damn it. Out of gas. But you know what? It can start. That's a plus. Hmm, doesn't seem like there's anything in here whatsoever. But if we could get this thing started, if we if we could get some gas, dude, we'd be good. Ah, we'd be set. Okay, let's see what else we can find around here. He is right, he would bleed out. Okay, what do we got in here? We got water. We got uh we got our matches. Sorry, it's empty. <coughs> Damn. Damn. I could have saved it. Around. I love my backpack, but he's still so sad. Clementine, please cheer me up. By, uh, can you tell me a joke, uh, Clementine? Well, um... Well, uh, Timothy, there was... There was this kid once. And he met a clown. And that clown told him a joke. But I'm not that clown. Uh, Clementine, I don't really get the joke. It doesn't make any sense. That's the joke. <laughs> You're not funny, Clementine. Why don't you tell me a real joke? Okie dokie, I suppose. Two guys walked into a bar. What's in there? One guy Anything we can use? said to the other guy, Give me one of Ooh, what do we got here? Probably tastes like pine tar by now, but I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. Oh my god. Give him cigarettes. You got a light? What is with Clementine's little smirk? All right, let's light him up. <laughs> well, that tastes about as bad as it smells. Now what? It looks as bad as it smells. <sighs> we wait. So two guys were in a bar, right? All right, Timothy? And one guy said to the other guy, Do you know Nick? No, nah, Nick who? Well, his last name is Gers. Uh, Clementine, I, I don't get the joke. Oh man, he's definitely zombified. Oh, buddy. Okay, we gotta get this figured out now. Alright, we gotta cut this off. Gotta cut this off. Pete is just about to turn into a zombie. What the hell am I going to do with it, anyway? Let's check on him. Are you alive? <laughs> Barely! Well, man, I told you, cigarettes are not good for you. Oh, damn it. I feel like 10 pounds of shit in a 5 pound sack. <laughs> Yeah, me too, bro. I can relate. Jesus. Stuck in this can the whole damn day. You want to hear something funny? Yeah. I've been thinking. And I don't want to die. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> That's funny. I have a similar story. Oh, I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that. There it is. I'm scared, Clementine. I am laughing Jesus on the scared. inside so hard. It ends up like this. Yeah, you never think it's gonna happen to you. It's pretty depressing, actually. Would you... Would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? I love that stupid kid. No matter what you think. Sauron couldn't look out for Nick. A man made out of eyeballs couldn't look at for Nick. I can't make any promises. I'm a 12-year-old girl. How am I supposed to look out for a 25-year-old man? Been on 
almost today. They ain't gonna find us. He's super special. Where are you going? Oh, they're gone. I'm not getting out of this. You're gonna have to make a break for it. I'll buy you some time. There's got to be something out here. Um, you coming with me, me bro? To do what? Die a couple hours later than now? To say goodbye to Nick. All right. I'll try. Well, like my daddy used to say, <clears throat> we're burning daylight. All Let's right. Get this over with. All right. Let's do this. Uno, dos, tres, go! Oh my god. Anyways, I'm gonna have to save the rest for tomorrow. Or not maybe the rest, but another part until tomorrow. So I hope you're excited. I know I am. I can't wait. I'll see you tomorrow. Adios!